free D for you. America. God bless America. <laughs> Well, it is hard to forget these guys. They marched up the coast in a pretty unusual fight against PTSD, and they are at it again. As 10 News military reporter Hannah Mullins explains why they are headed now to New York City. The Reverend Warriors did their first story with me last month. They'll just be wearing their silkies, their combat boots, and a smile. And for some reason, it blew up. Now they're headed to one of 25 hikes that have been planned. I want you to fly with that thing. They cuss, they drink. Donnie, 316. And Jesus said unto thee, <laughs> let's get hammered. And at times, they're just gross. You got your swamp ass and your mud butt. Or it could be vice versa, you know. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? You really want to know. <laughs> Trust me, you don't. But there's more to them. Donnie O'Malley lives with his grandma, and he nearly gave her a heart attack. The girls love this. Are you, are you serious? Those right there, that's what put Danny through college. <laughs> he was actually a Marine who survived war only to lose a friend on home soil. I thought, damn, if I had just done something more. He started Irreverent Warriors and got 70 people to hike 22 kilometers for the 22 vets a day who take their lives. The intent of every hike is to pull veterans out of a depression. Just by bonding and laughing, someone saw our story and organized a hike the next weekend. Donnie's mission is spreading across the country. We had absolutely no idea that it was going to blow up like this. He's as humbled as he can be. <laughs> he certainly gives grandma the giggles. Get away from there, that's not nice. <laughs> Grandma will admit she doesn't mind silkies on the other guys. You know, I want to see something. <laughs> Donnie couldn't be more offensive. I had a heart attack. And that might just be saving those who have served America. us. God bless America. <laughs> Sorry, ladies. He's taken. <laughs> we posted a link to Irreverent Warriors on 10news.com. Just click on the red TV button. Hannah Mullins, 10 News. Who would like to have a good time? They are headed to New York tonight, which is having one of three hikes this weekend. Donnie O'Malley posted this challenge, encouraging Donald Trump to hike with them. They say it's, this is not a political thing. He said he just supports the troops, and they want Trump to prove it and join them in silkies, of course. That I would pay to see. Not a, Yeah, it'd be great to see, but not a chance Trump's yeah, going to do that.